Baldur. Thanks, Pat. Um, a couple things. Um, just one quick clarification um, in the uh, counter strikes. Did the U.S. Uh, hit three or two? Was it three strikes or two strikes? Uh, uh, two, two different uh, facilities, so two strikes. Two strikes, okay. And then uh, secondly, can you uh, talk a little bit about the protection at the uh, base where the Iranian uh, drone hit? My understanding is that there was some um, either lacking protections there. Can you say whether or not any of the radars or aerostats or anything that are there uh, either failed or were not operating? Is there adequate protection there now? How did the drone pierce the security of that yeah. base? And then I have one follow-up. Sure. Uh, so first of all, uh, broadly speaking, uh, for operation security reasons, I'm not going to get into the specifics in terms of, of the types of force protection capabilities uh, we have in our facilities, other than to say we take force protection very, very seriously. Um, I will say, you know, as it pertains to radar, my understanding is uh, that there was a complete sight picture in terms of radar. All that said, uh, as is the case in any type of attack, uh, U.S. Central Command will conduct a review to assess uh, what happened and take a look at what, if any, other type of mitigating uh, actions need to be taken. Um, but it would obviously be premature to, to talk about that. And then your follow uh, Just a quick follow-up on the, the actual uh, uh, situation now. Obviously, uh, the U.S. Um, was struck again, Green Village was hit again in response to those re the U.S. retaliatory strikes. Are things escalating there? Can we expect more? Is this um, turning into a far more escalatory situation in Syria for the troops? Sure. Um, and, and as you highlight, um, this morning at approximately 8.05 uh, a.m. local time, which would have been uh, 1.05 a.m. Uh, Eastern time, uh, we had 10 rockets that targeted coalition forces at Green Village in northeast Syria. Uh, the attack resulted in no injuries to U.S. or coalition personnel and no damage to equipment or facilities. Uh, in terms of escalation, look, again, our focus in Syria is on the defeat ISIS mission, and that will remain our focus. We do not seek conflict with Iran. We don't seek escalation with Iran. But the strikes that we took last night were intended to send a very clear message that we will take the protection of our personnel seriously and that we will respond quickly and decisively if they are threatened. You go to Fadi. Uh, 